All right, what's up guys? Welcome to the Nature Boys, and today we are doing the gorilla versus the giant panda bear. All right, get a close up of them guys, huh? Mm -hmm. Look at that gorilla, it looks strong, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, all right, so what we gonna talk about first? The panda bear, the giant panda bear. All right, so we're gonna talk about the panda bear first, huh, Keila? Uh huh. All right, so let's move this guy back and see we can so we can talk about this panda. All right. All right, man. Let's get a close up look at this panda bear here. What's he look like? It's, isn't it sad that these guys are cute and cuddly, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I'm itching my back. I'm itching my back. That's right. <laughs> Hey, baby. Yeah. Cute and cuddly. Sometimes vicious. Sometimes vicious. When? When are these panda bears vicious? Either they're protecting their cubs or they are And the zoo maybe yeah. being yeah. agitated by mean human beings? Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's get a full view of this guy. Let's have him. Look at his cool markings on him, huh? Mm-hmm. All right. Even though this panda is cute and cuddly, we're going to show you something. Big clips of him being very vicious. Oh man, all right, let's check him out, guys. <laughs> All right, well, let's uh, let's see here, buddy. Uh, where does the panda bear live? They live in China. China, cool. All right. All right. And let's see, what does the panda bear like to eat? He likes to eat ninety-nine percent of bamboo for his diet. Oh man, ninety-nine percent. Okay. All right. That's a if there's one animal that lives up to the saying, you are what you eat, it's probably the giant panda. Nearly every aspect of a panda's life revolves around bamboo. Giant pandas eat, and eat, and eat. Pandas can spend more than half of each day eating. To understand why pandas eat so much, you need to look more closely at what they eat. Bamboo. A giant woody grass is a very poor nutritional source, low in protein and high in fiber that pandas can't digest well. Yet, bamboo comprises 99% of a panda's diet. To compensate, pandas need to eat 20 to 40 pounds a day. Pandas have quite a bit in common with carnivores. A panda's digestive system is more closely related to that of a carnivore than an herbivore, which explains why they don't digest plants very well. Fortunately, they have other adaptations that help them chow down on bamboo stalks, including large, powerful jaws. What does it say? Okay, well, how much does this guy weigh eating all that bamboo? 350 pounds. This is the male giant panda bear, right? Yep. Up to 350 pounds, that's a pretty big fella, man. Yeah. All right, how tall is the giant panda bear? He is four to five feet tall. Four to five feet tall? Yeah. All right. All right, Keenan, sorry, man, we're flying through. All right, so how uh, fast does this panda bear run? That's 20 miles per hour. 20 miles per hour? The yeah. Panda bear? Yeah. Running that fast? Man. Yeah, he's, that's he's pretty scooting. fast. He's scooting for a big fella. Okay, man. Um, now let's get down to some. How strong do, do they say this panda bear is? They said they can lift up to 250 pounds. 250 pounds. Okay, that's a lot. All right. And um, what is the panda bear's bite force? 245 pounds per square inch. Oh, pretty strong bite, huh? Yep. Okay. All right. All right, Keelan, so now we're on, we're gonna do this time, it's a cool fact, and funny. but it's a little bit funny, right? Yeah. Uh, okay, all right, so what you got for us? Okay, so the giant panda bear poops more 
than a hundred times a day. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that's, that's pretty cool, but kind of gross, right? <laughs> right? And where does that come from? So the bamboo has, um, what in it? It has a whole... It does all that pooping, I guess, because the bamboo has a lot of fiber Flavor. in it, huh? Yeah. Fiber and mostly made of water, so. And poop. And poop. Since they don't digest bamboo very well, pandas end up passing a lot of it as waste, which unsurprisingly contains a lot of undigested bamboo bits. Pandas defecate more than 100 times a day, producing more than 40 pounds of waste. Pandas even go number two while they're napping. And they spend a lot of time napping as a way to compensate for their low energy diet. A lot of pooping from this big guy. I'd hate to, hate to be behind him walking, huh? <laughs> <laughs> All right, man, so now we're gonna get to the big old gorilla. All right, guys, so now we're starting on, what is this guy? A Eastern Lowland, Lowland Gorilla. Silverback gorilla. gorilla. Let's see a silverback. Silverback right. right here. Look at it, yeah, okay. So it gets, becomes silver as they mature, as the male gorilla matures. Yep. Okay, all right, so that's a pretty cool guy here. All right, so let's get into it, man. Where did they say that, uh, uh, Eastern uh, silverback gorilla lives, huh? In the mountains of Africa in the Democratic uh, Republic of the Congo. Wow, that's a lot of big words there, buddy. Good yeah. job. Man, all right, so Congo. All right, man, well, what does this big guy like to eat, Keena? He likes to eat uh, 104 different species of plants. Man, that's a lot of plants, okay. Uh, what are some other things that he eats besides plants? Rodents, bugs, and ants. Oh man, sometimes he's picking at some rodents, huh? Yeah. Like them rodents, how big they are. All right. And... It's differ based on the species, but in general, gorillas mostly consume foliage such as leaves, stems, and shoots. Up to 25% of their diets can consist of fruit and aquatic herbs, as well as insects, preferably ants or termites. Since these herbivorous apes eat such nutritionally poor food, they need up to 40 pounds of foliage per day. In order to gather this amount of food, gorillas have developed incredible arm muscles that are believed to be several times stronger than those of a man. Gorillas are not big fans of the water. They usually try to avoid open water sources and usually hide from the rain. Luckily, gorillas do not have to drink water often, their diet mainly consists of succulent vegetation that contains enough moisture and is usually covered by morning dew. Uh, okay, and how much does this guy uh, weigh? How much does the male gorilla usually weigh up to, buddy? 500, up to 550 pounds. Okay, on the average, all right. All right, and let's see, how tall did he get? Did he get six? Four to six. six. Four to six feet tall? Okay. All right. Put on the speed, buddy. How fast can this guy run? 23 to 25 miles per hour. Oh, man, that's pretty fast. He'll track you down, huh? And he can climb a tree, huh? Yeah. Most of them. Okay. All right. And... All right, Keenan, how strong do you think this guy is? He can lift up to 1,800 pounds. Okay. All right. Let's get a big old arm. Let me see the muscles on that guy. Right here. Oh yeah, you can see them. All right, big old muscles, okay? Thousand eight hundred pounds, that's a lot, Keith. Yeah. All right, and... We're gonna show you some clips how strong this gorilla is. Oh man! <laughs> How long does usually this gorilla live, sir? 35 or 40 years. 45, okay, that's a long time. He's doing this yeah. earth. 
All right, and next up is the cool fact, son. What kind of cool fact we got for this guy? Okay, he has the third most powerful bite force in the world. Whoa, how, how strong is that bite force? 1,300 pounds per square inch. Man, that is one strong <laughs> mouth there, huh? Uh-huh. Ain't from chewing on that bamboo, huh? Mm-hmm. All right, okay. All right, guys, and just for the fun of it, you know, usually these two guys were not, usually a panda bear does not want to fight unless he is trying to defend for his baby or defend himself. And same goes for the, the gorilla, gorilla, right? He doesn't usually want to do anybody any harm. But... Yeah. <laughs> he will they are very aggressive if you go and see where they're at. Right? Where they're living at and to the way they're living. Alright, so we're gonna do a countdown here just for the fun of it. We're gonna do five rounds, right Kim? Five rounds? Five. Five rounds, yeah. All right, and the giant panda bear versus the silverback gorilla. All right, Keelan, round one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, for the first round, buddy, we're going to do weight. Who weighs more? The eastern lowland gorilla. All right, yep, he weighs more, up to 550 pounds on average. So he has the first round. All right, round. he's got the first round. All right, buddy, now who is taller? The Eastern Lowland Gorilla. Oh, man, this is this is look good for the panda bear, huh? He, hmm. He's in trouble. All right, strength. Who's stronger? <laughs> gorilla yeah. got the gorilla on that one. Yeah. Ding ding ding. All right, and round four. How? Who's the fastest? The Eastern Lowland Gorilla. Man, okay, this is right now, guys. This is a <laughs> blowout for the gorilla. It's not really a match right now. All right, and the fifth one is the bite force. That's a very important one yeah. in the animal kingdom. And who wins on that one? Uh, gorilla. All right, man, so out of five <laughs> categories, this fella right here is pretty big, right? Panda bear is pretty big and vicious. But against the gorilla, what do you got, Keelan? Who's the winner? The gorilla. Silverback gorilla, no. <laughs> Contest, right? No contest, man. Not yeah. close at all. Not close at all. <laughs> Maybe we should have put this guy against a more formidable opponent, huh? Yeah. All right, so that's pretty awesome, and uh, we got we're gonna put a lot of pictures on here, and we we'll we're gonna be doing a whole lot more, right, Keelan? Yeah. Maybe a whole lot of animals, and maybe some more dinosaurs. <clears throat> all right. What do you tell everybody, man? Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell. Give him a big thumbs up. Big thumbs up. All right.